Hello and welcome. This is Dr. Jerry Cuomo. I'm here with my uh, referred patient from a uh, local periodontist uh, that wants me to go ahead and examine uh, tooth number 19. It's a Branamark implant with an external hex. And uh, the external hex um, now has the, uh, the abutment screw is loose and it is covered by... Um, by some composite and I'll have you turn a little bit toward me right and you can see I'll just demonstrate um, it has mobility so it's not really abutted up against the adjacent uh, bicuspid so we want to help help her by removing the um, the screw it has a stripped head so we have to go ahead and, and formulate a method of, of getting that screw out. And one of the ways we're going to do it is to, first of all, secure the crown. That's the first and most important. The next thing to do is go ahead and clean out the access hole, go in and identify the, the head of the screw and find out if it's a, and how bad is it, and, and, and what we can do about it. Sometimes we can slot it and place a smaller screwdriver in there. Sometimes we have to just go in there and place a small dimple and then use another uh, driver to unscrew it and then the third uh, possibility is we just go in and actually just grind it and and then it comes out we replace the uh, the loose screw and uh, and then can go from there and it shall have a much better situation and less less issues so I would say Brandmark, uh, we're looking at either 80s or 90s 1980s or 90s uh, when that was uh, first used and designed now since that eclipsed by the uh, Nobel uh, select design and active design. All right, so we'll pick this up on the next clip. I got to go through some paperwork with her and uh, we'll see you.